Hello there, everybody. So, Rogue Legend here, and I'm back for, playing for you guys. I am Setchana. We are actually going to partake a deep fried crystal lettuce so that way our party can go into this boss fight slightly buffed. Ooh, that's a big. I think I should have actually grabbed Cure for this. Hey, look at that coming out of his body. Isn't that... <laughs> the spatial distortion. I see. So those distortions of space were being seen all around here, all around the mainland. You think this thing is what's causing them? Yikes, if that... If it is, that means this guy definitely needs to do some small fry, doesn't it? Thing's kind of big, isn't it? I don't think kinda is the word. But why, though? It's changed. It definitely has. Changed? You've seen it before? Well, yeah, a long time ago. Come on, that's enough chit chat. We need to finish the thing off before it finishes off us off. Be careful, everyone. <laughs> Bruh. Oh. Alright, so you got the counter attack up. Got off the lightning cleave. I wanted to actually use blow blow beat, unfortunately. <laughs> Smack. I am not a fan of this creature already. Okay. I got the boy. Now he's provoked. He's got way too sensitive this turn. Can is it? Seriously. Stop that! Oh my god. This is actually lost. The only thing we can really do right now is just yeah, keep using the uh, I'm assuming we can go that quick. I'd love to know where this dodges, where these dodges are coming from. Yeah. Now we're 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 done. This guy somehow just goes incredibly quick and... Ugh. Okay, next time we, we don't wait. Inventory... We saw... Uh, maybe... Number of drops... Can we eat two? I'm gonna switch out party members uh, right here real quick. I think we need the Turna. I'm gonna try to see what abilities they Aterna and Setsuna share. Brilliant. Sanctity and slow. So Turner does not have slow. I think it's uh, Setsuna who does not have on Sanctity. Uh, yeah, she does not. Uh, that's back on. Let's switch out. Switch out Demi, actually, for slow. There we go. Alright, let's see how this works this time. 
Yeah, yeah. Already starting up like hard. Right. Oh. Uh. Crap. I keep forgetting what ability is it of his that gives him. Yeah. But regardless, we can actually now. Oh, come on with that. Survived. And he did not get. Oh, you need to stop. Is this fight actually doable right now, or am I just not of level? We actually should try. There's the confusion, and there's the stun. We have a chance. I'm gonna have the turn to try to him as well. Maybe, maybe it's just status effects for this big guy. Back end here. He's acknowledged who the threat is. Let's try, let's try a Dream Shatter again. Okay, she got the status. I do not like this creature. I do not like how quickly it attacks. Can you stop? Okay, Setsuna, you're two. Turn up, bring it back. And watch as he kills him again. I hate this creature, officially. Can you not? Now he's confused and stunned again. Let's see if people survive this time. I'm sounding a little salty, I know, but that's because, like, he keeps doing this. And you're basically gonna get up just to die again unless I can heal him in time. I'm trying. Okay. Dream Shatter again. Let's get the stun off. Let's try to do something. Can we heal in time? No, we can't. I'm actually just gonna have to get the turn this turn to come, Jesus Christ! Okay, water. Wrong character! Oh my god. He needs to stay alive. I thought I switched the time. If this ends up, he's down again. And Eterna needs to hit him with the Dream Shatter again. But she can't. And we're, da we're down and out again. I hate this creature so much. Yeah, no, we're, we're down again. Okay, game. How about we try this? Uh, 
Astros, Lightning Rod. And I actually want to try Kira, because I think this thing's going to be weak to fire. Ugh, actually, no, we can't afford to have Kira in, because we need Tetsuna in. Alright, take three on this fight. Yes, yes, I know this already. We, we've lost twice to this creature. I'm not exactly pleased. He attacks quick and, like... <laughs> oh, good. Our first turn is you healing Setsuna already. Uh, which one does... I don't think he has it on, actually. Ah, here we go. Yeah, you just stay still for a bit. She's gonna just avoid damage for a bit while we pseudo set up. And what what can we set up right now? First off, we're gonna see if light is actually his weakness. And we're gonna freaking bump low again. Yeah, let's get it. Didn't work. Scorching Rush on Setsuna. Miss, miss. No more hits. I'm gonna send Julie to jump again if she could go. That is it. I mean, as long as he keeps focusing on... yeah. Why? Why? Why all those extra hits for, bro? Missed it. It didn't work again. I might actually need to turn it. And... He's getting hit. Julie's gonna come back down. Julie's back down. Up again. Oh. Please get stunned and stop being a jerk. Oh, good. Naturally, speed recovery. Jump. Just, just keep going to the skies, Julie. I'm gonna have to equip that one of those spirit nets that tells you the enemy's HP too, because like we're not seeing his HP wrong target because I'm rushing because he attacks so quickly. There we go. Now you hold still for a bit and stop being a prick. To the sky. No, we actually are going to provoke this. Uh, you know what? And this, miss, miss, and this, 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 miss. And from the skies. <laughs> Some light resistance down. Got to do that with Julie again. Gonna take a little bit of damage. I'm actually gonna use this turn then to. Uh, uh, let's actually prepare. I got the boy. All right, so Nid's gonna take the damage. Can is it? Smack. Go. 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 Go.
He goes twice before that one of my guys can go once. Oh. I, I, I might actually just need to turn up for this too because of the fact that she can legitimately. Wrong target. My God. Okay. This turn's gonna be spent having Julie give Setsuna uh, the the grass. Okay. Okay, he's sorry to Julie. That kind of makes you a little bit happier. Okay, we're gonna actually. Ooh. Okay. Just in time. Can we do this actually this time? Hey, how about you not target Setsuna? You giant prick. Status ailment. Oh. Okay, I need Can you? He's actually ignoring mid at this point. Kind of making him a little upset. Crap, it's not gonna make it in time. She's down. Now we're on the back foot. And watch him hit. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna provoke this time. I got the boy. Provoke. His defense is up. So he's doing the jump. And. Set to my heal yourself. Having his defense up actually seems to have been probably one of the best things that could happen. Ooh, nice. Yeah, as long as the defense is up, we'll be fine. So now he's ready to counter. Of course you hit Setsuna. Because your AI told you- I'm getting, I'm getting salty. I'm getting real salty. Because whenever he has- I need to provoke and counter up, but I can't do both at the same time. Because he does this. He like- he seems to be actually getting a little weaker. Oh, is he a Mike Tyson fight? I think it's a Mike Tyson fight. Stop that! Uh, stuff's just going on wrong. Yeah, now you can hit him. Now he's in counter stance and. But it's it What? What? Are, oh, oh! Oh! Julie did it! That's my pay right there! That's my girl! Julie did it! Get wrecked! Ah! Eh! Ah! You can't see it. I'm basically. Yeah, legendary monster, ha, huh, was the match for us? Shut up, Kira, you were not in this fight in any of the party makeups. I, you know what's funny? I was worried that we were gonna get KO'd against Sweden. Yeah, it, it, it's, 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 um, either he gets weaker the less health he has, or he, he attacks quick, but he has no health bar. Oh my goodness, I, I thought we were gonna get KO'd again. I was about to be very upset. Be careful, it's not over yet. Uh oh. Wait, what? <sighs> What's wrong, Julene? Julene, don't tell me you're still. 
power that dwells there. I must see it with my own eyes. Oh dear. I must continue on. The distortions in space have disappeared! It's a huge monster was causing them after all. Let us hurry on. Are you sure you're all right, Julie? Yes, I'm fine. Why do you ask? Never mind. As long as you're all right. Okay, what's in this little area before we go and save and end the episode? Because that monster boss fight took so long, like I thought. I didn't want to be right, though. All right, so we now have another idea for a team. It's just basically one who can't be hit, one who heals a lot, and one who tanks a lot. I guarantee you, that fight would have gone so much better if, like, I potentially had a Turna to help with guaranteeing more status procs, but... Let's, let's, let's read up about it before we end this episode, as we often do. Furred monsters. Freaking... The... Aurorean Tiger. A brutal beast that inhabits the depths of the Frigian Caves. Its phenomenal magical energy was the cause of the spatial distortions seen across the land. These distortions were, in fact, not only... Spa... <sighs> and its... And time itself was distorted in the area, surrounding the monster. This is why I was able to cast elemental magic in, short, in such a short time. At least multiple attacks in the space of mere in, in the space of a mere instant. I don't care that I didn't get those other kills. He's a jerk and a prick. I don't like him. And his face is ugly. Yeah, I said it. Friggin' hell, I might spend I might go see if there are any like monsters here that I can fight for a brief period of time. Just so I can be able to fight it, fight some, fight the next, whatever boss monster's next, with more ease. Like, I feel like I should have leveled up more, definitely. There were no spirit light infused monsters in the area, so I'm just sitting here like, what do I do? I could go all the way back to fight them, to fight the other ones I saw, but I feel like that's way too much of a waste, at least not without some form of transportation or teleportation. Uh, I've been so babied by it in other games that it's now, not having it makes me feel like, Man, why bother? Anyway, I want to thank you all for watching. I do hope you enjoyed this very long boss fight episode. If you liked it, please leave a like on the video itself or subscribe to the channel for similar content. And of course, sharing with a friend or two really helps me out. And if you guys, if you, your friend, or anyone really enjoys it, you can always check out the playlist. You know, skip these last segments of where the outro is. It's not that hard to figure out where the outro is. And until the next video, big, big thank you for watching. I messed it up again. Is and big thank you all for watching. So the next video, I just want to say, later's been messing that up mostly. I gotta get used to it. Later's.